हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वी हैव अ क्वेश्चन हेयर इन विच फोर सेल्स आर कनेक्टेड हैविंग सब्सिक्वेंट इंटरनल रेजिस्टेंसेज आर कनेक्टेड सच लाइक लाइक डेट एंड आर एक्सटर्नल रेजिस्टेंसेज ऑफ टू ओम इज कनेक्टेड बिट अलॉन्ग द डायगनल ऑफ दिस ऑफ दिस फिगर सो we have to find in this question that the potential difference between b and d between terminal b and d we have to find the potential difference and we have to solve this question with the help of kirchhoff first kirchhoff law so before solving this question we must understand that how to distribute the current and second thing how to apply the kirchhoff second law so to um, understand how to how to distribute the current let us suppose we are starting with the current uh, that how much current we are giving let us suppose from this cell we are taking i1 current and if we are taking i1 current from this cell then we have to give i1 also that's why i1 we are giving these these cells i1 and if we are taking i2 current from these cells Then that's why we are giving I two current here. So input current equal to output current. That's why whatever whatever current is releasing from these cells, we have to give them back the same current. And at this junction B, these current I one and I two will add up to um, to go in this external resistance. So this is this is how the current flows in the circuit. now um, let's uh, let's learn how to apply the kirchhoff second law so to apply kirchhoff second law we have two rules so <clears throat> two rules regarding emf and regarding potential difference so um, to apply to apply second law if we are moving from negative terminal to positive terminal of battery then we have to take uh, emf of battery bat of that battery as positive and if we are moving from positive terminal to negative terminal of battery then we will take emf of battery as negative and if we are moving in the opposite direction of current then we have to take potential difference as positive and we are if we are moving in same direction of current then we have to take uh, potential difference as negative so let us suppose we have a circuit here where a, a, a cell is connected having internal resistance and an external resistance is called also connected like that and we have to apply the kirchhoff second law so let us suppose we are moving we, we are moving like that in clockwise direction then if we are moving we are moving we are starting from here then we are moving from negative terminal to positive terminal because we are moving in clockwise direction so from negative terminal to positive terminal we will take emf as positive that's why we will take e as positive e then we will move on also i forgot one thing we have to flow the current let us suppose we are taking i current from this cell then if the current is flowing from this cell is i1 then we have to give the current same current back to the cell give 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 it back to the cell that's why now we have taken emf of battery because we are moving from main negative terminal to positive terminal that's why it is taken as positive now in internal resistance we can see here that we are moving in same direction of current current is also moving like that and we are also moving like that that's why we have to take this product i and r as as negative because we are moving in same direction of current that's why we will write it as minus i r now we will reach this resistance and the same current is flowing in this direction so in L, at this point the we are moving in the same direction of current that's why we will take it as minus sign so minus i r now after moving from this resistance we will reach cell again that's why we will stop here and it will we will write it as zero and this is the equation of kirchhoff law that how we have applied this kirchhoff second law the same principle we are moving we are using it here in this question so have a look at these rules of kirchhoff law and try to apply in this question now we have we are seeing that 
दे आर आर टू टाइप्स ऑफ करंट इन आर सर्किट करंट आई वन एंड आई टू डेट्स वाई वी हैव टू मेक टू इक्वेशंस टू गेट द वैल्यू ऑफ टू बोथ द करंट्स बिकॉज इफ टू आर अनोन देन इट मस्ट वी कैन सॉल्व दिस बाय ओनली टू इक्वेशंस डेट्स वाई वी आर टेकिंग टू मैसेज वी आर टेकिंग मैश मीन्स टू लूप लूप सो वी हैव टू टेक लूप लेट एस सपोज फर्स्ट लूप इज दिस एंड सेकेंड लूप इज दिस सो एप्लाइंग सो वी विल राइट एप्लाइंग के वी एल के वी एल मीन्स के वी एल मीन्स किच ऑफ वोल्टेज लो किच ऑफ सेकेंड लो एप्लाई के वी एल इन मैश वन फर्स्ट मैश तो सो टू एप्लाई के वी एल लेट एस सपोज वी आर मूविंग इन क्लॉक वाइज डायरेक्शन इफ वी मूव इन क्लॉक वाइज डायरेक्शन दैन वी विल स्टार्ट वी आर स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम एयर दैन वी आर मूविंग फ्रॉम पॉजिटिव टर्मिनल टू निगेटिव टर्मिनल एंड फ्रॉम पॉजिटिव टर्मिनल टू डिगेटिव टर्मिनल वी हैव टू टेक माइनस ई सो इट वी विल मेक इट माइनस टू माइनस टू देन देन आफ्टर दिस वी विल रीच दिस इंटरनल रजिस्टेंस सो वी आर मूविंग इन दिस डायरेक्शन एंड करंट ऑल्सो इज इन द डायरेक्शन सो वी हैव टू टेक आई आर एज निगेटिव सो वी विल टेक माइनस टू आई वन देन देन वी विल रीच दिस दिस After moving through this mass, we will reach this resistance. Then <coughs> we are in this direction, and current also is in this direction. That's why we will take it with minus sign. So minus two into I one <coughs> plus I two. <coughs> and after reaching this, we will reach this resistance. And here also current is moving in this direction. We are also moving in this direction. That's why we will take one I one. <coughs> and after this we will reach this cell and in this cell we are moving from negative terminal to positive and on moving from negative to positive we will take e as positive so plus 1 and then same rest same cell we reach that's why we will write it as equal to 0 on solving this equation we get we get mm, yeah, this i1 तो माइनस टू आई वन माइनस टू आई वन माइनस आई वन इट मीन्स माइनस फाइव आई वन एंड आई टू इज माइनस टू आई टू तो माइनस टू आई टू एंड इफ वी सी द कॉन्स्टेंट्स देन माइनस टू एंड वन तो इट विल बिकम माइनस वन इक्वल टू जीरो सो दिस इज आर फर्स्ट इक्वेशन सो अप्लाइंग सिमिलरली अप्लाइंग Applying KVL in mass two. So on applying KVL in mass two, we get, we get. Let us suppose we are starting from this resistance in clockwise direction. So in this dire, in this case, we are moving from in this direction and current is flowing in the opposite direction. That's why we will take it as positive sign. So it will become two into plus two into I one plus I two. Now again, then then we reach we will reach this cell, and in this cell we will reach from minus terminal to positive terminal. That's why we will take it as plus one, and then internal resistance. Now current is also in opposite direction. That's why plus one I two, and then at this resistance, current is opposite is in opposite direction to our motion. That's why we will take it as positive sign. Then with three. Plus three I two, and in battery we are moving from positive terminal to negative. So that's why we will take it as take it with negative sign, and then it equal to zero because we are we reach to the destination. And that's why <coughs> on solving this I one, we get two I one, and two I two plus I two plus I two, we will get. Two, one, three, and three, six, six, I two. Uh, minus mm, one minus three. It means minus two equal to zero. So we get both equations. In this, <coughs> in this, for this we got two equations. For these, for these two loops. so on solving this equation how to solve this equation let us suppose we are multiplying equation 1 by 
सो ऑन मल्टीप्लाइंग इक्वेशन वन बाय थ्री वी गेट माइनस फिफ्टीन आई वी विल गेट वी आर राइटिंग इट हेयर सॉरी वी आर राइटिंग हेयर इट हेयर इट विल बिकम माइनस फिफ्टीन आई वन एंड माइनस सिक्स आई टू इट इज़ द सेम प्रोसीजर बैट वी यूज टू डू इट इन लीनर इक्वेशन इन टू वेरिएबल्स इन नाइन्थ और टेंथ क्लास सो इट विल बिकम माइनस सिक्स आई टू माइनस थ्री इक्वल टू जीरो सो ऑन एडिंग ऑन एडिंग इक्वेशन लेट एस सपोज इट इज वन ए ऑन एडिंग ऑन एडिंग ऑन एडिंग ऑन एडिंग वन ऑन एडिंग वन ए एंड टू वी गेट एंड टू वी गेट वी गेट माइनस फिफ्टीन आई वन प्लस टू माइनस फिफ्टीन आई वन प्लस टू आई वन वी विल गेट माइनस थर्टीन आई वन एंड माइनस सिक्स आई टू प्लस सिक्स आई टू इट विल कैंसिल आउट इच अदर दैन इट एंड इट विल गेट माइनस फाइव इक्वल टू जीरो आर एच एस विल गेट एड अप बाई आर एच एस एंड एल एच एस विल एड अप बाई एल एच एस सो इट विल बिकम आई वन इक्वल टू फाइव अपॉन माइनस थर्टीन और माइनस फाइव अपॉन थर्टीन सो वाई दिस माइनस साइन एपियर्स बिकॉज इट इज सेंग दैट द करंट विच वी गॉट इज इन द अपोजिट डायरेक्शन टू डेट करंट विच वी हैव टू डेट डायरेक्शन विच वी हैव टेकन सो so in circuit the current the current which we have derived is original is moving in this direction so don't worry about negative sign it is just the it is showing just the direction of current so we get the direction of we get the value of i1 now putting value of i1 putting value of i1 i1 in equation In equation, let us suppose in second, second on putting it on second, then we will get two into minus five upon thirteen plus six i two minus two equal to zero. So we will get minus ten upon thirteen plus six i two minus two equal to zero. Then we will get we will get on taking two common or if you don't you don't want to take common then we write it as 2 plus 10 upon 13 it will become it will become 13 to the 26 plus 10 36 upon 13 then 13 we it will not cut so 36 upon 13 Thirteen. So, so we will get six i two equal to thirty six upon thirteen. Now six six are thirty six. So i two equal to six upon thirteen ampere. So <coughs> we got this value. So now to find potential difference between point B and D, we have to we have to see in the circuit. Let us suppose this. So, if we want to, if we want to know what is the potential difference between B and D, so V B D, V B D, potential difference B and and D. It that potential difference will be because of this resistance. So I one plus I two into two I R V equal to I R. so putting values putting values of i1 and i2 we will get the value of i1 is <coughs> value of i1 is minus 5 upon 13 so minus 5 upon 13 plus value of i2 is 6 upon 13 6 upon 13 into 2 so we will got 5 6 minus 5 1 upon 13 into 2 So V V D equal to two upon thirteen volt. This is the required answer. Thank you very much.